it felt good to get some sleep. What's going on, my Pluxies? My name is Depluxy, and welcome to the fourth episode of Depluxy's Minecraft Dream. Today's dream is to make like a mini sheep farm, kind of similar to the cow farm we have here, and make a kitchen. Now, I have no idea why I want to make a kitchen, but I dreamed it, so you might as well do it. So, we're going to do that. So, the first thing we need to do is make the sheep farm. So, we're going to be a how wide? Three. And then, same size, five by five. Two, three, four, five. And then, yeah, everything's going to be the same. I want to have a, a proper sheep farm, but for right now, we'll just have this. Now, I'm going to show you guys where I want to put the kitchen, because I have to go... It's going to be in the, the little hole we have, and I have to go up there, or down there anyways, because I need a, a um, trap door. But it's going to be... It's going to be right here. So we have the mine on this side, and then we're going to have the kitchen over here. So let's get the trap door. And then for the kitchen, I'm just going to get all the materials that we need. And then once I do that, we'll start making it. Now I'm probably going to need to go down to the mine and maybe mine uh, one of the, I guess, mines. Because I want to get some more coal. Just to, just so we have enough um, stone bricks, because that's what I want to have in the design. We're also going to need the sheep because of wool. We're going to have um, blue wool, light wool, light blue wool, and then white wool. Mm. What am I trying to do? Oh yeah, I need to get some wheat. I need traps. I need to put some of the sheep in there. We have one piece. Hopefully this will do. Okay, let's go over here. I don't know. I don't want you. Just, I just want the white sheep. Down here. Okay, now I need to get one more. Or not one more, two more. Come on. Is there any sheep over here? There's, oh, there we go. Come on. Over here are the sheep. Come on. Over here. I know you see it. Okay. Now we need to go down in the mine and get some lapis so we can uh, change the sheep color. Sheep's color. Okay. There we go. Now let's go down there. I'm pretty sure we have some lapis that is down here. I think it's right, yeah, it's right here. So we're going to get some of this. Now we got to head back up. Let's make this symmetrical. Now we got to head back up and make some light, bl light blue wool. Yeah, I really need to do something. This takes so long to climb. I need, come on, I'm almost there. And once we're up here, let's go in our chest, get some bone meal. Which we have some right here. And then, make some light blue wool. There we go. Need one piece. One piece. Okay, that's, that's dye them. You blue, you blue, you light blue. I'm pretty sure we don't have shears, so I'll just make some right here. Shear some of these. Oh. Okay. Now that we have all that, all that done, I'm gonna smelt some cobblestone and just get all the stuff we need to make the furnace. And when I have all that, I'll be back. Okay, guys, I'm back from getting all the stuff I need. This is all I got. I actually did a lot of stuff off camera. I bred and killed some of these cows. I added a little bit more sheep just to speed up getting the the wool I need. And I got some sugar cane. Um, 
as well as that cave that we found down here I got a little bit more iron and coal because I needed some so now all we have to do is dig the room now I don't know how far I'm gonna go but maybe let's see maybe we could go like three blocks down or three steps down so one two and then one more is three and then right here then we start digging so I need to make a seven by seven area which will happen now so this is all done now we need to make the we need to dig the ground one more and make the ceiling one more which will happen now and now all we have to do is fill in actually wrong block we actually need to alternate between the blue wool and the white one so like this and then actually hold on before we do that we have to fill in the sides with stone brick now I hope I have enough for uh, the walls I, I should have enough so we just do this and then I guess we let's just take out the whole entire thing so the whole walls need to be stone brick so it's gonna be like a 5x5 five five area but yeah. like once you see it 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 seems like enough more than enough room so let's do this pretty sure we'll have enough to make some more and almost done just need to do this one and okay oh. we also need to do this part too okay just one more my bad actually we can remove this one because that's how we get up but now now we do the alternating so on the it's gonna be what our blue white and I think it looks how it turns out looks pretty cool we also need to do the same thing for the roof okay and we do the top Actually, I want to. I want to. Wanted to match. Oops. They're almost almost done. I think this kitchen turns out nice. This is my um, own design. I've created it myself. And then now we're gonna add. Oh, wrong block. Now we're gonna add on this. We're gonna add a um, what is it? A dispenser. And we need to craft a an iron door and a button. Like that. And then we also need to make a button. Uh, wrong one. Okay. Which goes on the side, and then we can put food in there. We don't really have that much food, so we're not gonna do that right now but later on we will and then right here goes a lever and then we're gonna make a cauldron nope not a minecart it's one more yeah goes right there and then on these sides we actually need to go over here we're gonna add or wait, not that one. Now these dispensers over here, these are going to act like little cabinets. Like, I don't know, this looks like the drawer or whatever. And then we need to add a torch. Right there. Okay. And then on these, on each side, we're going to put a, um, a crafting table and a furnace. We also need to put some water in here. We need to put swords and shovels in these, but we'll do that. We can either, hmm. 
I guess we can do that right now. We won't put a, a lot in there, but it'll be a good start. So this is going to be the, what is it? There's the spoons. And the shovels act like knives or like forks or something. It's out of wooden door here, so it's like a pantry and then it opens. And the last one is, we need to make a sword. Let's make two. Okay. And then these go, these go in here. So this adds a little cool effect. And then on this side, we're going to add a little dining room. So we need to make some stairs. Uh, this should be enough. And a sign. And a fence. And the last thing I think we'll have enough. What is it? No, it's not that. What? How, how do you make it again? Oh, it's like this. There we go. We're going to make a weighted pressure plate. This goes right here. Chairs. Oh, wrong one. That's like the little table, and then the signs act as like candles. Okay. Now we have this part done. Now, last thing, we're gonna add a freezer. So it's over here. It's not gonna be that big. It's gonna be. Mm, let's see. How big should it be? Maybe. Maybe like a, a three by three room. So, the, I'll dig that, like this, and now all we need to do is fill in the light blue wool. I think we'll have enough, but if not, um, there might be some, yeah, we're, I don't think we're going to have enough. But this is going to act as like a freezer, so the light blue is, I don't know, like cold. I guess the blue would, no, the blue would be like, too much, I guess. I think the blue, the dark blue goes good with the white, and then this acts as like a freezer. But uh, I don't think we have enough. I'm gonna go in. Or I guess we can go and get some more wool from up top, or our sheep farm. But we need to make uh, three chests, and then these are gonna go on like the corners like this. And, I don't know, we can just put, like, eggs or something that needs to be in the refrigerator. Not ref well, I guess this can be it. But, just filling this whole thing with eggs is not going to be that if, uh, productive or efficient. So we'll just put that in the, the freezer. But, let's see if we have any more wool. I'm pretty sure we do. Yeah, th these sheep have grown. If not, I'll just do the... I'll just fill in the rest off camera, but this is what the, the kitchen's kitchen looks like. I think it looks this looks really cool. But I've created this um on uh I used to have a survival world and I made a kitchen like this. So how many one, two we need three more pieces of wool. Uh I think I know what to do. Hopefully. Actually, I don't think I'm going to have enough. Let's see. Maybe we could... We'll have... We'll make two. We'll make a... Two light blue. And then what we could do is... Do this. So maybe we'll have enough. If there's any more sheep up top. Oh, we're one short. Come on. One of the sheeps... Had to have grown at least one... Or wool. And of course not. Okay, well, I'll I'll just do the the last piece off camera unless the sheep just like suddenly grow a piece of wool. Nope, there we go. Oh, he just he gave us the just the right amount. Okay, now that we have this piece, we need to do one more thing, and that is make a door. Okay. Nope, don't put that right there. We need to put this. 
There we go. Okay, so this is uh what the kitchen looks like. This is act acts like a, a sink or a faucet, and then that we need to put some food in there, more swords and shovels. But yeah, this is it for the kitchen. Finished design. Now I hope you guys enjoyed this episode and enjoyed uh, my own design of the kitchen. I think it looks pretty nice. And leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe, comment, and I'll see you Plexies in the next episode.